Hi, welcome to our exciting adventure at Universal Studios where we will take you on a journey through thrilling rides, magical worlds and unforgettable experiences. In our last episode, we showed the Simpson ride and the amazing Jurassic World ride. Next we tried the Mummy ride, it was an experience like no other, filled with heart pumping thrills and excitement at every turn. It's an experience you'll never forget, standing next to a real transformer, feeling its power and energy up so close. With rush of adrenaline, you snap a picture, capturing the moment forever. Sector 7, we need you to report ASAP. Four shower out. <laughs> So the game closes at 6.15, we made it at 6.5 and uh, this is one of the most important uh, tour that you want to take in Universal Studios. Yeah, this is the last show of the whole day. So studio tour, then uh, Jurassic World, then uh, Mummy Ride, Transformers Ride. These are a few of the best attractions out here in the Universal Studios. You definitely shouldn't miss it. Do not forget to grab the free 3D glasses for this amazing tour. What I want, and then I'll change things up on your monitors really quick. These are some of the worlds that were once created inside of that stage. Over so the stars, stars like Rock Hudson, Jimmy Stewart, Morris Day, Lucille Ball, mostly during the Golden Age of Hell. Nowadays, these are production offices to some of the biggest writers. Universal Studios is a popular theme park and movie studio that has been the site of many famous movie sets throughout its history. Universal Studios has a rich history of producing and filming movies. Some of the most iconic movie sets at Universal Studios are The War of the Worlds, Frankenstein Castle, Jurassic Park, Harry Potter, A Beautiful Mind, King Kong, Transformers, Back to the Future, etc. More than just a ride, this 3D simulation provides an accelerating rush of adrenaline. Just enough 
student which one. So shift your focus to your left. Some other well-known vehicles here at the back lot. Some of those cars are going to become just as famous as the actors driving them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, some of the cars from the distant, distant future in 2015. That was the year they went back to the future. Seven years of the making, we did it. Good job. We had some prehistoric cars from the Flintstones here as well. These are also not so real, mostly Paul Barber and Barber Boss. This is beautiful. And Warner Brothers so now the Harry Potter, Chamber of Secrets, Fort Anglia. Here at Universal, two of our biggest franchises, cars and dinosaurs. Fast and Furious 10 has already filmed and is coming to theaters in 2023. Oh, really good. And by dinosaur fans at Gyrosphere from Jurassic World, which, by the way, we all know the virtual co-host of oh, the I think there are some dinosaurs loose here for that part. Like the spine source. Or as some of us see it now, look at those sprinkler systems. We usually keep that out of the view of the camera when filming the production. You know, we just use sprinkler systems, shoot that water out, falls down as naturally as possible, have complete control over the entire environment. We were blown away by the set that showed disasters and accidents. It was truly impressive. great experience if you are in Los Angeles and Los Angeles itself is the land of Hollywood and uh, international movies so you should definitely visit Universal Studios is highly recommended go for all the rides especially the studio rides then the Jurassic Park ride mommy ride if you love roller coaster then uh, if you're into simulation ride then do visit the uh, Transformers yeah. and also there are a few others yeah overall it's a beautiful experience so most importantly you need uh, a lot of time so do come to the universal studios right in the morning do try to visit by night so that you can uh, cover most of the attractions the reason is you will spend a lot of time just standing in the line so we spent around like two hours standing in the line so the queue is long uh, in every ride so you need to wait at the minimum 30 to 40 minutes for each ride it's it's very crowded especially try to avoid if you're a tourist try to avoid um, the weekends because in the weekends it will be very crowded and also the festive seasons yeah 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 so yeah overall it's a it's a five star
Go for it. If you found our video entertaining, please show your support by liking, subscribing, and leaving a comment below. Thanks for watching.